Hi everyone, today we're going to talk about music therapy as a career option for psychology majors. So if you are passionate about music and interested in helping others, this presentation is for you. So music therapy, according to the American Music Therapy Association, uses evidence-based music interventions to help people achieve their goals. It's done by trained professionals and it can address physical, emotional, cognitive, and social needs. The primary goals of a music therapist are diverse and they're tailored to the needs of each individual client. They include promoting wellness, improving communication, and promoting physical rehabilitation. Music therapists can be found in schools, long-term care facilities, private practices, hospital settings, and more. So let's hear a little more about the role of music therapists in a hospital setting from Children's Healthcare of Atlanta. Music has the ability to relax the mind and body and it can conjure up positive memories and for our patients and families who are facing a critical illness in the hospital, that can mean so much. As music therapists, we are trained to structure music experiences in ways that are accessible and meaningful for patients and their families. We know rhythm plays an incredible role in the recovery of movement, the recovery of speech, and even the recovery of our breathing and coordinating that breath that we need. Music therapy is integrated into the patient's care alongside the medical team and rest of family support services so that the patient has a feeling of total care throughout their treatment. Music therapy has been effective when it's offered the opportunity for a patient to work toward their medical goal. I think one of the greatest ways that we know music therapy is effective is when a patient actually asks for the music therapist to come into the room and be a part of the procedure that's going on. A lot of our kids have really come to rely on the skills they've learned from the music therapists for better breathing, for coping through procedures, um, different types of relaxation that they're learning with the music therapist. I think a lot of times kids, um, you know, then become able to do some of that stuff on their own. They learn with their music therapist how to gain the skills and then when they're able to do that independently that is a huge win for any music therapist to be able to say you didn't need me through that procedure because we worked together and you actually learned that skill and now you're able to do it on your own. If I can eliminate worry or pain for my patient and their family for even just a short time I know I've done my job. Music has the so Let's talk about what can you make doing this job. Salaries can vary significantly based on location, experience, and specific work settings. Salary.com reports that the average salary for a music therapist in the United States is approximately $50,000, with the potential to earn more with additional certifications and experience. The job outlook for music therapists is positive, with an expected growth rate of 7% from 2020 to 2030, which is faster than the average for all occupations. There are a couple of possible pathways to becoming a music therapist. First, you can earn a bachelor's degree in music therapy from an accredited program. This includes coursework in psychology, music, and therapy methods, as well as supervised clinical training. After completing the degree, aspiring music therapists must pass the board certification for music therapists exam. This is administered by the Certification Board for Music Therapists. However, some positions may require a master's degree in music therapy or related field. Music therapists should possess a variety of skills and proficiencies, including strong musical abilities, excellent interpersonal and communication skills, empathy, and patience. They must also be proficient in assessing clients' needs and developing individualized treatment plans. Additionally, music therapists should be adept at using various musical instruments and technologies to facilitate therapy sessions effectively. To stand out when applying for graduate school or on the job market, it's important to gain practical experience through internships and volunteer opportunities. Joining professional organizations such as the American Music Therapy Association can provide networking opportunities and access to resources. Developing a strong portfolio showcasing your musical and therapeutic skills, obtaining additional certifications, and staying updated with the latest research in the field can also enhance your application. 
Thank you so much for joining me in exploring the career of music therapy. It is a rewarding field that combines the power of music with therapeutic practices to make a significant impact on people's lives. If you have any questions or need further information, feel free to reach out in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more career insights.